what's up guys and thank you for joining for our pocket tuber friday yes finally doing this and hopefully i can do this next week too uh, i want to thank everybody who came to the stream so this is of course a live narrated battle from that stream and this was a very interesting battle against tesla mouse tesla mouse or james is a good friend of mine from a few weeks back actually or through months even he has been somewhat absent on his channel but he's still, you know, around battling. He just hasn't gone around to do another narrated battle. So I think I was actually the last guy that uh, he battled before, you know, going off for, I think, two or three months here. And he won a rematch because um, during my Yuji week, I did actually pull off a win against him. And uh, he wanted to set the record straight, and I get that. And uh, we said mixed here, and he brought uh, probably one of the bulkiest OU teams I've seen in some time. Of course, Sigurd is one RU, and I do believe that uh, Nido King or Blissy is UU. Other than that, though, super potent team, really scared of the Rotom, really scared of the, actually Sigurd. They have a tendency to screw me over. But other than that, my poke should definitely deal with his team very, very nicely, and it turned out to be a very good battle. Uh, none of that, guys, you know, stay tuned for the after comments, too. Uh, and other than that, enjoy. But it's genuinely bulky. It, lo it doesn't have a lot of HP, but it got that shared bulk that just makes it easier for it to deal with almost anything. So I I'm really scared of that. Why I freeze at random time? I don't know. I don't freeze. At least not on my side. Um, I haven't dropped any frames either. So I don't think it is that bad. Hmm. All right. Other threats in the team, I would say Nido King is threatening if I can't outspeed it. Yeah, Mega Scepter is actually gonna be that guy for that. Mega Scepter is easily going to uh, take care of Rodan. Any Rodan. At least, or not, of course. I'm, I'm being stupid. Of course, Rodan Heat and Rodan Priest is gonna equal deal with that. Alright. The thing is. Do we Volt switch or do we want to try to match me? He could also switch into uh, his Nero King, and that would have been actually been an excellent play of his, his side. Um, but I don't like to do the early game swing uh, predictions. I'm just going, I think I'm gonna jab a little with him here. Right, the size of stays in here. And that did nothing. That did really nothing. Hmm. Ah, shit. Do you hear Volt Switch now? I'm gonna rip my hair off. Like a boss. So yeah, that, that, that could work in my favor. So obviously you can't do too much in my hand times. Right, he decides to withdraw. So there's the Blissey. Nasty! Nasty poke. I decide to withdraw too. See there's a golden opportunity to switch into my Bugra. Fear me. You don't have to fear me, but you have to be a little scared of me. That, that would be fine. So right, you got the leftovers. I definitely got the softball going there for sure. Do we go to his scrotum? That's the question. Let's see how interesting this really can get there. Let's do it. We're gonna decide we're going to Vulcan. 
and um, just see what he decides to do. I think he can easily wall that out. Oh, toxic. Naughty boy. You really think you can withstand my power? You're probably right. I am a little scared of this guy. Alright, soft walls, and I got the superpower. Shouldn't take it out. Oh! Mm. Fuck you, Blissy! Fuck you! Ugh. Hate that poke! <laughs> uh, not actually aimed at you, uh, James. I just, I hate Blissy that much. Such an excellent wall. Ah, Gigalith, my hero. Oh, there's a scrotum. Obviously I dropped a little defenses here. And attacks, so I can't really stay into this. Man, I'm good. Thing is, he knows that I pack War Absorb. He could go for Bolt Switch, and that would actually have been fine. Hmm. Yeah, I. I am a little scared here. He wouldn't go for a hydro pump. That would have been too too crazy. Or would it? Should be. Yeah, I'd probably go into Ether. Ether can't take anything specially offensive. Um but I don't have any good switch in here. Rotom covers too much. So yeah, I did go for Volt Switch, so a good thing I didn't go for Man Time. Obviously this is gonna hurt anyway. That really sucks they did. Ah, alright, alright. Needle King. Mm. Is it physical or is it special? Don't say 100% with you on cream. I actually don't mind that. Um, to be really honest, I see that as a good opportunity to share my knowledge. Um, this thing passed 100 volts, I know that. Got earth power, and earth power will do fair damage to me. Ooh, and I kinda wanna wall you out, but I know I can't. Hmm. Let's see here. Nidoking is such a potent poke too, I have a trouble with that. So far blast, that's good. Did fit the power. So obviously it was not, you know, maybe not the best switch in, he still has that Thunderbolt and um, but I can stall him, I don't think a Thunderbolt in life. Or Nido King will take me out because I'm very heavily special defensive. Um, he is definitely forced to switch out here. I know that. Yeah, like I said, he was very forced to switch out. There's the Sigilith. That is scary. And here's the Bugra. I'm getting that sand stream up, that, that is always, always fun. So right, that is... I know that's it. God damn it. We got the Cosmic Stored Power going here. Hmm.
Let's see what it decides to do. There's a cosmic power, damn. Damn, 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 damn. damn. Take it out. Oh no. Oh no. God damn it. I gotta get walled out. There's nothing I can do. There is nothing I can do. I don't want to forfeit, but at the same time, there is really nothing I can do to turn this battle around. He can just, you know, ruse, cosmic power. Ah. God damn it. Well, I guess we can hope for a crit. That is probably about it, so. <sighs> yeah, I hate when battle turns like this. Sorry guys. But my other, like, Hippodon set had actually... <laughs> had the room roar because the people were trying to do stuff like this. This battle is obviously going to look something like this, so um, I'm going to actually decide to forfeit because I don't want to showcase battles like this. So, uh, GG James, um, like I said there, don't really want to showcase the stall battles. Uh, so it was a fun battle until this, so not a huge fan of the custom power set there. But it's super potent. Uh, not a fan, not a fan of that set. So yeah. I fell really short here and it does suck. Giga Impact with uh, my fourth was my best shot at it. And sadly I couldn't stop it from setting up. And I really just, I didn't want to continue the game. Because I've been in these situations before and it comes down to if I get a crit or not. And uh, I have to acknowledge that uh, I... I was the worst player here. I my team wasn't built for this situation, and it really showed. So it was a very fun battle right to this this moment, and I really felt that I was powerless here, and as a result lost. So kudos to Cecil Mouse for uh, pulling that one off. I definitely, definitely didn't expect me to lose like that, but it's a part of the game, and uh, you have to be built. This is a very real situation. And other than that, guys, you know, thank you as always for watching. And don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed this battle. And also check out Tesla Mouse channel. Other than that, take care, guys. Alright? Bye.